Hi, I'm Miss Sue and this is Virginia. Today we are going to make paper cup dolphins. So Virginia made one in advance so you could see what it'll look like. So she painted it and put two fins on it, a tail fin, and she did a mouth and eyes and we used little pipe cleaners for the spout, but you don't have to use pipe cleaners. You could go get sticks from outside or straws. So the first thing we did is we made sure we had some paper cups. You can paint them, but you don't have to paint them. An alternative is to cut up, I cut up some construction paper different colors and get glue, any type of glue you have, and start gluing the different color paper on your cup. It's a fine, good fine motor skill for kids to cut and then take individually and glue and um, put the paper on. So no matter what way you do it, you have a choice. So she'll continue doing that. Um, one thing I did was I got white paper. I basically fold it in half and cut a heart. And that is my tail fin. So that goes on the back of the dolphin. Then I just cut two raindrops, they look like. And those are my two side fins for the dolphin. Um, you can draw, once if you use paint, once it dries, you can do a face. Whatever you like to do, if you use construction paper, you can glue your items on that. We have googly eyes or these little teeny pom-pom balls, or you can just cut circles of construction paper that are different colors and put them on the face. Um, one thing you'll wanna do is help poke holes at the top of your cup so that they can insert the straws or the sticks or the pipe cleaners in that. And that is, um, a simple, easy, fun activity. The cute thing about these are you can make multiples and you can ride them around on your tabletop so they can play games or acti do activities with those. Hope you have a great day. Take care, bye.